This is the uh, safety bar slash handle from a Boogaboo Buffalo and the uh, Boogaboo Chameleon uh, 3 as well as the Donkey uh, are similar and are pretty much the same in relation to the um, thing I'm going to show you on this video which is how to swap out the white button here on the side of the safety bar. So they've changed this. Before you had to pull the white button out from the front and it had two small clips, uh, kind of like lips on the sides of the white button where it sat in. And um, we noticed over the years that that lip broke very often. So most likely the changes now with this uh, new button on the safety bar are in order to fix that and it has fixed that problem. So um, you can twist this this way to get it the back side and you're going to need a screwdriver with the uh, really small star typed screwdriver head. It's the uh, 10 millimeter size and you're just going to unscrew it here and there is a spring on the inside so you want to be a little careful when you do it because um, as often happens with Boogaboo there are small springs and they can just jump and you'll never find them again if you're messy like me. So there you go, there's the spring, it fits on this little peg fits in the hole and we can pull out the button and you can see that there's like a lip that goes all the way around the sides of the button whereas before again it was just a very small lip here at the bottom that could break so that's how you remove it if you were to put a fresh one in and you would just slot it in like this attach the spring onto the little peg and might be better actually to hold the button on like this. It makes it a little easier to get the spring into the hole. It goes in and then you just screw it in place. So we haven't had any problems with these new buttons breaking yet, but uh, if you have a reason to swap it out, now you know how. And uh, let us know if you found this video because you have a Chameleon 2 or a Chameleon 1 and you have the older white button and you're having trouble getting a hold of it because there is a way to alter the newer button with a Dremel such that you can uh, put it into the old uh, safety bar. So if anybody requests that, then we can make a video of that at some point in the future. And I just wanted to say at the end that uh, if you found this video helpful, please subscribe. Uh, it really means a lot for the channel. Uh, it does a lot of help for us to keep making videos.